What's up, family? Get over to the 4th Dad's Mary Lee. Today is January the 14th, 2024. So for Sunday in my city, Chicago. Look, family, real talk. I asked for $2 million tax-free in 1995, right? Because I felt like I was, you know, somebody of importance, right? And I felt like $2 million tax-free wasn't no money compared to Oprah almost being a billionaire, a half of a billionaire. I didn't know at the time. Otherwise, I probably would have asked for more. They don't even want me to have the $2 million tax-free. They just want to kill me and make an example out of me so other people won't be uh, trying to fight for what they believe in. And that's integrity and honor. Long story short, I would have gave half of that $2 million to my best friend, Luana Joy Jacobs, just for standing by my side. But, of course, she didn't believe. You see this? This the one and the seven. I gave Oprah Winfrey my child abuse rap at the age of 17 in 1984. I thought people would get tired of, you know, bending over. You know, I said in one of my raps, you've been faking it and taking it so long, you don't have a backbone to stand up on. You know, all you got to do is watch that Sherman Hemsley, George Jefferson, moving on up. To the east side, to a deluxe apartment in the sky. So when they say the sky, they mean the sky for real, heaven, I guess. Not a um, high rise. Uh, man, the way he went out, man. <sighs> he let that white man just degrade him in that Saturday Night Live skit playing Whoopi Goldberg. It was disgusting, man. Where y'all fake that, man? We kings and queens. We going out like bitches and hoes. What kind of shit is that? Read your Bible. Jeremiah chapters 25 through 31. And because if it keep going, them bombs going to drop for real because people don't got no soul no more. You understand what I'm saying? Oprah, where you at? I'm disappointed in you. And everybody's sugarcoating her shit. Man... Shame on you. Peace.